Hi, everybody. My name is Kate Harris, and I am going to be your instructor for the next 16 weeks for our Totally Asynchronous class, which begins on Monday, the 28th. So this is just a welcome announcement and just to say a couple of things to get you started and also just to give you an idea of what the class holds for you over the next 16 weeks. The first thing I want to mention to you, and I hope that you will take this to heart, this is a difficult, difficult, difficult class. I don't mean to scare anybody, but I also want everybody to know that this class demands a lot out of you. There are six, six speeches. And that's really not the hardest part. The hardest part is keeping on top of your time management issues. So I know, sorry, piece of hair in my mouth. Okay, so the bottom line is that if you are not sticking to the schedule and meeting every single deadline, there's just no chance that you're going to pass this class with the kind of numbers that you'd like to see and the numbers that I would like to see for you. So the first thing I want to say to you is that you're all extremely amazing people. All right. You're at Roosevelt University and that is amazing. Okay. Now with that knowledge, I want you to take on this class robustly and attack it. If you will, don't let it become a lackadaisical kind of a easygoing situation for you because it will not be. So my suggestion to everybody is that even though everything is, you know, lined up on Blackboard, everything is there for you. Okay. Take it one week at a time. Don't try to look at everything at the same time. I know a lot of times we want to rush to the end. I know I'm one of those people that likes to sometimes read the end of the book before I read the first, of the book, first part of the book. Don't do that. Okay. You've got to take yourself through each step. So my first suggestion is to look through the components on Blackboard under content, which are located on the left hand side of Blackboard. And I have given you, I'm giving you an audio explanation of Blackboard, how to use it. I'm giving you an audio explanation of the syllabus, an audio explanation of all of the assignments. And what is another audio explanation that I might, I can't remember at this moment, but they will also have physical hard copies. All right. My suggestion is this. The weekly lessons that are available to you will really keep you on track each week. Like this coming week, know that you have a quiz that's going to be due by a certain date. So you are really in charge of this class. I am here to assist you in any way that I can. And of course I will do that. But the bottom line is, I'll say this again, is that you need to stay on top of the management of this course. One thing is, you cannot hand in all of your assignments at the end. You cannot hand in your assignments whenever you like. There are deadlines and you must meet them. I will say this, I have said it already when ex explaining verbally, all, you know, the, um, the syllabus. You, if you do not get an assignment in by the date, by the time that it is listed to be due, you cannot hand it in. So please do not come to me with an excuse like I forgot or I didn't know how to do this. You know, the list could go on and on. You can be excused if it is a dire situation. This means that you're in the hospital. Somebody that you love has passed away. You have a serious illness. You need to go visit a courtroom for whatever reason. You must have official documentation from the police an obituary from a doctor's note. And that, you know, if you have a problem with scheduling from work, you need to have a manager write me and let me know what happened. There's none of this. I didn't get it in on time and just, you know, do this, the assignments whenever you want. I will not accept them. So please know this. You are not more important than anyone else in this class. So give that up. Everyone is equal and everyone deserves equal treatment. And I will be doing that accordingly. Please take this into high, high consideration when you take this class. All right. The other thing is, what is the other thing? 
I think that this class gives people a nice view of exactly how to do a speech. But to actually have that happen, you must read the rubric line for line for line for understandability. I say this jokingly, but if not, you'll never be able to put IKEA furniture together. I don't know if you've ever tried to put IKEA furniture together, but if you do not follow it step by step by step, you're going to have, you know, legs going this way and, you know, a chair upside down. Believe me when I tell you, I have attempted to put things together with IKEA without reading the directions and it's been a mess. It's been a hot mess. You must read the directions. You must look at the lectures. You must follow this course to the T. And what I mean by that is that th this is like, I've set everything up for you. Now it's your responsibility to get this work in. That doesn't mean that I'm not there to help you. Make sure that you're looking at when I answer emails and when I don't. When I will meet you for Zoom to discuss whatever you like and when I won't. So make sure that you're reading the syllabus and you're listening to the syllabus for understandability or this course will be right over your head. And I don't want that to happen. I want you to be successful. I'm here to help you be successful. But I'm just letting you know right now that this class is difficult. It's not an easy ride. And the other thing about this class you should know is that two of the speeches, two of them, are going to be live in front of the class. So make sure that you look at the syllabus and the calendar for this it is designated by the state of Illinois that at least two classes are in front of live people. Last semester I tried to work it where people actually did it in a classroom in front of their peers. It didn't work. So we're going to do it on Zoom for two nights. Make sure you look at the calendar. I will give a presentation list fairly soon depending on how many people are in the class at that time. That will be important, but I will give a presentation list of when people are going to be, but clear your calendars for both of those evenings. There's no excuse not to attend. And so all of that information, I will also have a, you know, I have visuals of the assignments and I will verbally go through all of them. All right, I can't think of anything else to tell you, but just to know that this is a difficult class, but you can do it. However, you have to have good time management. Otherwise, this course will get away from you and you will not see the numbers that you want. This class is difficult, it is not easy, but when you get done with this class, you will be a better speaker. It helps with self-esteem, it helps with organizing thoughts, and just remember, this class is not about making your own rules. The schedule of this class, you revolve around the schedule of this class. This class does not revolve around your schedule, all right? That is so important to know. And just know that everybody is equal and nobody has special uh, treatment for whatever reason, okay? Except if it's a disability, all right? So there's that. So that's the bottom line. Also, just something funny to note that the lectures, I look different in practically all of them because I've been doing these lectures, like I did them over COVID, I redid some of them for various reasons, but it is all me, okay? So that's that. Well, listen, much love. To you and your family, stay well, stay safe, stay healthy. You can do this class. I'm here to assist you. And good luck. Thank you.